Hey guys, welcome to my first uh, workout tutorial. So today's Monday, and uh, we're gonna be doing push-ups. So each day we're gonna be doing a different thing, of course, and that's gonna be Monday push-ups, Tuesday chin-ups or pull-ups, Wednesday legs and ab workout, and back to Thursday push-ups, and then Friday chin-ups or pull-ups, and then. Saturday we do legs and abs and Sunday we take a break and start all over again. So it's going to be like a routine. So first, one essential thing that you do every single time before you work out, of course, is stretch. Now, I don't know if you guys take protein shakes or not, Cassian protein shakes, uh, whey, mass, either one. But uh, what you could do is if you do take those, you would take those about a, a five minutes before you work out around there. So we're going to start with uh, some simple stretches. This is where you pull your arm over your body and then pull on your shoulder for the stretch. So you can hold that for 15 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, 12, 13, 14, 15. And you're going to alternate to the other arm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Loosen your arms up. And you're gonna do one where you pull your arm over your shoulder and pull on your elbow. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. You're gonna switch to the other arm and I'm holding it fifteen seconds for each stretch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I know it's going to be one more stretch, but I just want to talk to you guys about one thing. So, the type of working out that I do is more for gaining muscle, so like body lifting. And I started working out in October in 2014, and now it's March 29th, and, or 30th. Um, in 2015 and I've started in September or September yeah um, at 97 pounds now I'm uh, 130 so you can tell that you're de it's definitely works okay so we're gonna go on and do the last stretch here you're gonna get your arm and I would usually do this standing up but the camera's on a low angle and what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull your sh shoulder like this That's my cat Simba. He's a little, little creepy. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That's my other cat Jason. I'm going to do it with the other arm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, so if you guys want to stretch a little bit more, you can go on and pause the video and do some of your other stretches that you guys know. And yeah, that's it for the stretching. So now we're going to move on to sets, and I'm going to talk to you guys about some important key parts of um, doing push-ups or any other repetition working out. So when you are doing a push-up, you're going to want to keep your feet together, your back straight, and your chest at the same level as the bar. Now on this push-up bar slash chin-up bar, you have different grips. I'm going to talk about those later because I do different grips for each four sets. And I do about 16 sets 
of 15, 12, depends if I'm having a good day or not. And uh, I'm going to show you one thing in a few seconds about when you're doing a push-up on how to breathe because a lot of people work out and they don't breathe when they're doing it and really there's no point in working out because you're depriving your muscles of oxygen which your body needs to grow, right? At a certain extent. So you're going to get into your push-up form. And I said, feet together, back straight. And when you breathe, you're gonna go down. And while you're going back up, right? Okay. So once again, down. And you're gonna have to have your chest on the ground or the bar, depends on what you're using. And then up. You breathe while you're going off. So if you're starting off working out just now, or you started a couple of weeks ago, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna give you a little bit of uh, an idea on what to start with because a lot of people they start working out and they're like oh yeah I'm going to be bench pressing 200 you don't really want to start off like you want to build because everything in life is take small steps first maybe steps right so you're going to do low reps but high sets if you start working out and you're going to build your way up to a higher weight if you're using uh, weights or or a higher amount of reps when you're doing uh, non-weight workouts or prison workout. So okay, we're gonna go on and do our first set here. So you're wanna you're want, gonna wanna measure your heartbeat. Okay. So I'm gonna be doing 15 reps in each set today so because I feel like I'm pretty strong today. So go. Now one thing I have a bad habit of doing, um, but it depends on your opinion on push-ups, is when you do it looking up, usually typically you want to look downwards towards the ground, but I watched a video a while and I did it for a couple of months and I thought that was the right way to do it, when really looking down is, because it just keeps your back on more of a straight level. So in between each set, you're gonna wanna stretch between each set and move around. You don't wanna be sitting there lying down on your couch and you go do a set of push and lie down, right? So you're gonna wanna stretch each time between each set. And, uh, and we're gonna take about a minute, minute and a half, two minutes even break. For beginners, I would recommend three, five minutes between your breaks of your sets. And believe it or not, this is actually one of the key factors of working out is actually flexing. So you want to flex each, each one of your individual muscles that you use every day for 10 minutes a day. Because when you're flexing, what you're doing is your muscles are taking the shape of the form of when they're flexing, but really when they're not. So you'll have more shape. All right, well, we're gonna start on our second set now. So remember, you're gonna have your arms and your chest at the same level with the bar, with the ground, try to keep it vertical, lined up. And then you're gonna have your back straight and your feet together. You're gonna be looking at down at the ground.
<laughs> so one key thing you want to like work on when you're doing physical activity every day, or since I'm sometimes, or days a week, is eating a, a lot of stuff with protein. If you don't have protein shakes, or whey, or mass shakes, you're going to want to eat a lot of food like salmon, tuna, well, watch out for tuna because it has a lot of mercury in it. It's going to have a lot of protein because this is going to build all your muscle, especially in the morning and before bedtime. I want to talk about one more other thing, uh, drinking water. For me, I try to drink about three or four waters a day. Yeah, I've been skimping out a little bit on it. Uh, yeah, I've been cheating a little bit on it, but i got to get back onto that. Uh, what happens is your muscles, they absorb that water and when it contains that water they uh, not necessarily look a lot bigger but they have more weight to them or more mass to them and uh, that also strengthens your uh, movements that you're doing in your training so I'm gonna do about half of my workout with 15 push-ups and the other half of 12 because I haven't worked out for a good week, two weeks, week and a half, yeah, I'm around there because I got sick for a little bit and work break and all that stuff. Yeah, they wouldn't let me to the gym where I was staying at that moment, so I gotta slowly build back up to where I was before. Um, so I could Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys four different, or four, or uh, one more set, and that's gonna be going up to four. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna do that four more times, okay? In case if you wanna do it at the same pace as me, but for those at the beginning, do about 10 sets of, depends on how strong you are, if you're a little bit strong, do four push ups or reps in each set, then. If you think you're a little bit stronger, then go to eight. So we'll just test, test how, test and see how much you could do and when your, what your limit is and and uh, so on. So I'm gonna do one last set for you guys, and I'm gonna do uh, I'm gonna talk to you guys about uh, stuff I'm gonna be doing tomorrow, uh, legs and abs, and uh, and uh, so on. So I'm going to be making videos every two weeks, yeah? Every two weeks I'm going to be making uh, new videos for workout. So you guys don't just get bored of hearing the same old stuff I'm talking about. So I'm not, I'm not done at four. We're going to be doing this four more times after, but the camera's going to stop playing once I finish my fourth set. for you so far today guys and uh, just uh, keep at it stick to the routine remember just try to take advantage of uh, the body that God gave you all right well I'll see you guys tomorrow